Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another video. So today, this week's video has changed a lot. Originally, this video started as, hmm, let me do a video with the person people care about more. Kitty. So for this video, I wanted to try to recreate famous cat vines because anything a different cat can do, Kitty can do better. Yeah, go ahead, pull it through. Thanks, bud. Yeah, go ahead, pull it through. Kitty, you gotta pull it through. And the video, the more I started to film, maybe I could try to film it differently, but it just wasn't coming together how I thought in my head. So we're just gonna scrap that idea. I have another video with Kitty coming probably, I think, next month. But for today, we're gonna be doing something very different. To start this video, you may think YouTube is just filled with vloggers and drama. Hey! Hey, is that your tubby sparring partner? Suck your mom! All right, Suck clear your the mom. stage. Suck your mom! We gotta mom. clear the stage. Suck what is going on with YouTube? YouTube drama is so wild now. Anyway, what I wanna talk about on YouTube, there's a lot of low key YouTube channels that post not just like weird content, but content that maybe we should be worried about. So what I wanna do, I wanna go through some of these creepy YouTube channels. We could watch some of their videos and we could figure out if we need to report these to the police or something. The first one we're going to talk about, this one is pretty well known, but no one really knows what is going on with this channel. And this is the channel Robert Heltman, and all 10 videos were uploaded three years ago on the same day. And as you can see from the titles, the main character of this channel is someone called Daisy. So let's watch one of these videos. They get more views than me, so they must be better content. Yeah, it's just 50 seconds of this. Sometimes a random guy appears in these videos. Yeah, right here. Great. So from the research that I've done, no one really knows what this channel is about or why this person uploaded these 10 videos. People have made dedicated videos just talking about this and even them, it's just kind of theories they don't really know. It's a mystery. My take on this channel is that clearly this isn't a real body. I mean, just, I found a picture right here that doesn't look like a head. I mean, it's not that hard to fake these kind of things, I think. Next channel we're gonna talk about, this one is creepy just because of the idea, not even really the video. The channel name is Carrie Johnson. Sounds like a beautiful woman, right? Well, you'd be right. Wow. The beauty. My God. My whole life I've searched for a woman of this beauty. It's right here. Okay, but for real, this channel, it's basically just this creepy ass person in a mask doing stuff. Hi everybody. Okay, we get it. I think this channel isn't supposed to be creepy, and I think that's why it makes it even more creepy. Hi everybody. After researching this channel, what I found from it, I think this channel was made to help sell this mask. All of the videos link to this website where you could buy this creepy mask for $600. You can get Jessica, full head and female torso mask with breasts. Oh, it comes with breasts too. Okay, that's a little better of a deal than I thought. For only $600, you could be as sexy as Carrie. I don't know who would buy this mask because it's not, it doesn't look realistic unless you're like filming white chicks or something. Next channel we're gonna talk about, this one is very, very low key. The video only has 500 views and it's just this, a video titled Fetish and I couldn't find anything, anything about this channel. No one knows what it's about, there's only this one creepy video. Okay, this guy doesn't know how to light a video. Okay, so we're kind of skipping ahead. There's this guy and he's got two doll heads. And then honestly, I'm skipping ahead. Not much else happens after that. Look right here, he's he's letting the dolls drink water. 
And that's it, nothing else has been uploaded to this channel since 2017. I mean, realistically, me saying this might just ruin it, but I think it's just some guy trying to be creepy and get a viral video, but then it didn't become viral and it's just a video with 500 views and it's, he's just trying to be creepy. That's probably what it is. Next one, we're gonna talk about this one kinda quickly, cause it's not, it's not like that creepy. It's this channel, I Am Baghead, and well, it's pretty self-explanatory. It's a guy with a bag over his head, and I wish this channel got more views. They just upload videos like this. Uh, very random. There's also this one called Choice. See, like the production of these are so good. Sweet. So overall, I'm not too sure what's going on with this channel. If I were to guess, I would say that this channel is kind of like, what's that, Poppy? Kind of like her videos that it's supposed to make you question what's going on. I don't know, either way, I'm a fan of Baghead. In fact, I'm coming out, I identify as this now. Next creepy channel I found, actually I think this is gonna be the last one, and it might be the creepiest one because it's just a genuine guy posting videos, not trying to be like creepy. This is the channel, it's called Rob Gin Yargana, which basically backwards spells angry neighbor. And this channel, it's a guy that records his loud neighbors and posts videos of them on YouTube. And look just how many videos he's posted of them. There's so many, and they're all titled kind of the same thing. They're all marked with the date and time, and then it says loud, rude, annoying, noisy neighbors, asshole. So you can hear people talking. It doesn't even sound that loud. My take on this, I mean, I don't know his neighbors. They might be really annoying and loud, but there's something creepy about filming them and then just putting it on YouTube. Can, can he like go talk to them and maybe work something out? Look, and the titles change kind of slightly, like this one, loud, rude, annoying, noisy neighbors, ball kicking, mother shitty example. Look, sometimes instead of just a black screen, he puts memes on the video. You are shitty neighbors with a baby. Is that even a meme? And the thing is, there are so many videos, I couldn't even get scroll to the bottom. How do you check how many videos a channel has? 7,000 videos. 7,000, that's insane. Why doesn't he just go up to them and ask? Like, can you not be as loud? Maybe that could save a lot of time. Oh yeah, and you know what makes this whole situation really comforting? The fact that his profile picture is a bunch of guns. So, that's a nice detail. Okay, anyway, I think that's where I'm gonna end the video. Let's pray that this video doesn't get demonetized because I have a feeling it is, or age restricted because that has been happening more recently. Um, a little bit of an update. I think this is the third week that I've been moved into this apartment. And I don't know, I definitely feel like I'm kind of in this weird transition stage where I'm trying to figure out exactly what I want to do now that I'm out of school and moved. I finally kind of have like just a clear head to focus on YouTube. And just so many things like YouTube has changed so much with the demonetization thing. I've been doing YouTube a long time and I mean for the most part I feel pretty good and I have a pretty good idea of what kind of videos I want to make in the future. I just need to figure out kind of how to do it and I don't always have the means to do it. Um, but other than that, I think that's all for this video. Uh, give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Thank you all for making it to the end of this video. I love you guys and hopefully I'll see you next week.